Hey guys, so today I am in front of Lobster King and not only did I hear they have some of the best Chinese foods in town here in Honolulu, but I also heard they have some of the biggest lobsters. So I'm gonna check this place out and eat a whole lobster to myself. I heard it's gonna be like at least a 10 pound lobster. I'm super excited and ready to eat. Alright guys, so this place features live seafood, they got live lobster and live crab and one of my favorite ways of having lobster is when it's deep fried and stir fried in ginger and garlic and then also there's some lobster noodles on the bottom so I'm gonna get it served that way. Alright guys, look at this lobster, it's a 10 pound lobster fresh, they've got aquariums here, oh my gosh, cannot wait to eat this, it looks so yummy. Alright guys, here it comes, oh my gosh, look at that massive lobster plate, wow. Looks amazing. Thank you so much. All right, guys. So I'm gonna get started here. This looks incredible. My hair up. Wow. Okay. So my favorite part about lobster is the tail meat. Dude, this thing is massive. There's so much parts to it. I know I'm gonna get some hate on not cleaning the bone, but I'm not a professional lobster eater. So I will do my best to get all the meat. But we got a tail piece right there, and look how big that tail meat is. Oh my god. Mm. And the sauce is so good. It's starchy, it's garlicky, there's green onion flavor. Alright, let's bite this down. in your mouth you guys it's so freaking good yeah hawaii has definitely blown me away with the freshness of all the seafood and this lobster is like no exception mm. i love these noodles these noodles are soaked in this garlic green onion flavor and it tastes so good Now, when seafood is like fresh, there's a light sweetness to it, and it's so good. another piece of the tail here. See, this is why I like the tail. You just need to do this and then the meat comes off. I'm like, dip it in the sauce. Oh, okay. oh my god, you guys, the sauce is so good. Alright, let's try to eat one of these claws now. Look how big this claw is. It's so freaking big. I'm gonna use my chopstick to poke out the meat. There you go. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that beautiful claw piece. Make sure to 
pay out the little pieces of meat. Thank you. 
That one I feel like was a D plus, but <gasps> we're just gonna go back with these tails. Oh my gosh, like, these tails make my life so easy. the lobster was covering all the noodles but there's actually so much noodles in here
This is why I never do crab videos, man. I, I can't, I can't. It's too hard. I can only handle, handle lobster tails. Okay, this one was just an F. That was, that was a complete F, I admit it. It's just so bad. I don't know. I don't know how to do it. I'm sorry. I really just, I can't do it. I don't know what Ooh, ooh, this one's gonna come out nicely though. Look at that. Ooh. Mm. Massive claw. Well, most I say the only downside to this dish, well, two downsides. One is, but that's just the more of a me thing. I have no idea how to get rid of, get used to the shells. But the other downside is, I really couldn't get through these noodles till after I ate most of the lobster because it was all covered up. <laughs> Obviously, the tail meat was my favorite to eat because they were the easiest. Oh my god, there's one more. This is this is so hard. It was just all shell. I'm trying my best to like navigate it with my mouth, but. And get a crab picker where, while we're at that. And an automatic shrimp peeler. Honestly, that's like the biggest downside to seafood because there's so much like bone involved, like deboning. I think that's like the worst part about seafood. Otherwise, it's really good. <coughs> Careful of the little shells scattered all throughout these noodles. Thank you. 
pounds of noodles this was because this is actually a lot of stuff.
Oh, that's jasmine tea. That's so good. All right, my last piece of lobster. Mm. Thank you. My lobster was good until the very end, you guys. This thing was amazing. If you guys are looking for lobster, definitely check this place out in Hawaii. Seriously, these noodles are really good. They're just scattered little shells in here. You know what you can do with the broth? You can actually get some rice and put the broth inside. And that tastes really good. Lobster King. Lobster King. Lobster King. Lobster King in Honolulu. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And make sure to check out my website for all my merchandise. I've got clothing, prints, and stickers all up on there. And make sure to check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming and on my Instagram page. I do a lot of giveaways and on my Twitter page. I also give a shout out to where I might be so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey, okay? And then check out my other videos. And again, make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.